good morning it is uh, not so early in the morning like I'm used to for clinicals but I'm heading off to my clinical CPs rotation I'm so excited I hear that you know they got to see the NICU the PICU um, I don't know if they saw the nursery or not but that this is where I want to be the first part we go to campus and I don't know what we're doing maybe like practicing skills for like peds because we've been practicing skills but they've all been like for adults so I'm guessing that's what we are going to do today and then tomorrow evening into the night I'll be at the hospital I will see you after I get out from campus just to talk about like what we did or what we learned about I see you tomorrow um, so I can talk about my kids experience so I'm back from the first part of my clinical and we just learned some stuff I guess um just talking about his experience, um, learning about IVs. So it's like really cool learning about like what's on his unit, things like that. So it was really cool. I really liked it. I'm so excited, so excited to go. Like, I'm really excited because the kids that they get on their unit aren't, like, terminally ill or anything like that. Like, they probably got the flu. So, I'm like, oh, oh there's a sick baby. And they have, like, babies. Like, I know. I'm just so excited about it. Like, they hire new grads as well. So it's like, Tia could do really well. Like, show your passion for this. So he would be like, hey, you know, why don't you apply when you graduate? See if I can get me a little job situation going on. I like that. I'm really excited. I hope I have like some really fun and cute stories to tell you about and I'm really excited it's a rainy day it's a dreary day I look kind of a mess I got my granny glasses on but I am excited to follow Jesus <laughs> that's not how it goes but I'm excited because I get to go to Pete's tonight and I'm hoping I pick a baby baby or a toddler I'm trying not to pick anybody over like six years old Cause that's where my like expertise stopped so I'm trying to get somebody young so I I am leaning like if I work in a hospital I'm leaning more towards NICU and um, labor and delivery or mother baby which I talked to the guy our um, peds instructor and he explained you know labor and delivery and mother baby at least in the hospital that's close to me they're two different things so it's good to know I wasn't sure if it was the same thing or not so I'm okay with either one of those um, he was like really commending me and he said that it would be really good because um, I will have experience taking care of adult and children so he said that like if I ever want to leave I will be highly wanted be in all areas because I have experience taking care of adults bedside and I'll have experience taking care of children like babies bedside so that's 
good. I always like to keep my options open and that's the way I can do what I want with options staying open. So I'm really excited. I don't go for another like four hours, but just want to come here and just express my excitement. <laughs> Here we go. Here we go. Two peeps, 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 peeps. system to learn about my patient. I have a two week old and she's adorable but um, they were saying the family dynamic might be different for me and I can I can feel that. Um, it's more like the parents seem like they've had a hard life so I'm gonna see how that goes. The baby is so cute and I hope I can get some experience with touching her and like dealing with some a child so little like that's what I want to do so we'll see we'll see how it goes but the unit is so cute like they have like those lights you see those lights it looks like they're stars it's so cute oh I hear a baby like talking that's that's so cute I should have picked like the 19 month old, but or the 9 month old. But I wanted to do something different. And two week old is like little, and that's Nikki. Get myself ready for Nikki and mother baby. I know you can't really see me, but um, can we talk about love? Like, I thought I was okay with the health department, but that was nothing compared to Pete's. Nothing compared to Pete's. Like I could shed tears right now because it's like what I've been dreaming about since I was four, five, six. 15, 17, 18, it's always been pediatrics, and now that I experienced it, I gotta have it. Like, I can't, I can't have this night where not much happened at all. Like, it wasn't an, an exciting night because a lot of things happened. It was the fact that nothing happened, and I still loved every minute of it. I have to get into peds. I have to do peds, labor, delivery, NICU, mother, baby, something. And we did. We got to see the NICU. Um, we just got to see it. Like, we didn't get to do anything there, which, you know, I didn't expect anyways. But even getting to see it, I'm like, yeah. Like, I want to make a difference in a little baby's life. I'm in love. I am going to end this video here. If you liked it, please give me a thumbs up. Uh, comment down below. Like, when was the moment you realized what you were supposed to do in life? 
if you even came to that moment that moment yet just let me know and i will see you in my next video sorry that is so dumb